Hi guys, hope you are doing well. And in this video, we are gonna discuss about how you can score 60 on 60 in bio section in IIT exam. So without wasting any time, let's begin. Before starting the video, I will tell you that the level of uh, IIT questions uh, in biology is as much similar to the NEET questions. Just the thing is, it's not like very direct from the NEET line by line. Uh, rather they will ask some practical based questions on which you have to decide what would be the answer like if this condition is given then what will happen there are uh, direct questions also but you won't find as many as you find in need so that's the thing in IIT that you also should be prepared like uh, with the practical knowledge also so yeah that's the overall thing with the bio and let's move with the video the first thing is reading a NCRT line by line and highlighting those important points or writing it in your uh, book a special book in which you write uh, important by points given in a NCRT a textbook right and this is compulsory if you are preparing biology for your IED exam this is the concrete like the base thing you should must do to read an NCRT uh, that will help you to reach a 60 or 60 score in your IIT exam and trust me if you are trying that you will skip these things or you are just solve some questions I mean it won't happen and anyway you prepare for NEET exam also so many of you so you need like for NEET uh, NCRT is compulsory then yeah you might be reading the NCRT for your NEET so try uh, reading NCRT for IIT also and uh, yeah, with that, I will just end my first point. Let's move with the second. Okay, so the second important thing is referring a MCQ textbook like MTG or any other publication you use. Just use that. Don't switch to other textbook. And uh, throughout the preparation, just stick to one book uh, for your PYQs preparation. Whatever the PYQs were in the uh, past years and also there are some books which uh, gives you a sample questions for your NEET exam uh, so yeah that is what all about the second point that just refer one textbook which contains your MCQs previous years and also uh, sample questions like MTG I used to refer MTG and stick to that one book don't change any other book or don't just shift to any other book uh, throughout your preparation because that will that won't help you because you are used to with the one kind of graphics of the papers right which like the book has kind of graphics for each and every book right there are dif different graphics for each and every book so if you use one book you are used to it so this will help you to memorize the things I mean it happens with me so yeah I am sharing with you so that's the second point Let's move with the third. The third thing I would like to discuss is giving a mock test as always. I discuss the same thing or I will add the same thing in every video, right? Because the, this is the important thing which you should follow. So for the uh, exam, like the, for the test, uh, the same routine I will suggest you that uh, giving uh, one or two chapter wise test depending on your pace pace how you study chapter wise and i am sure that most of the neat aspirant uh, complete three or four chapters of biology because it's not like you had to solve the numericals or something like that you just have to read and sometimes you have to mug up yeah like that's the truth you have to mug up the things so it won't take that much of time for the neat people uh, for the je student it might take a uh, more time as compared to them so yeah at the end of the your uh, week a week weekend so give uh, one or two chapter wise tests depending how much you complete okay and uh, like periodically of uh, two weeks like uh, we, after two weeks each of two weeks um, you should try to give a subject wise test and uh, also try buying a test series to give a full length test like physics chemistry biology and uh, maths if you are preparing for maths uh, that will help you to uh, 
make your sitting duration longer right that will help you in exam also so that's why i'm recommending you and otherwise there are many free sources on uh, in, like available on the browser or the internet that i have shared in the previous videos you can go and check out and uh, yeah like one if i discuss here is iit uh, sorry nta abhyas app which will really help you to prepare for your neat exam uh, for your iit exam i'm sorry i mean i just slept with my tongue but yeah uh, the nta abhyas it contains all the neat uh, biology the practice questions which is uh, free of cost and it is provided by N N nta right so yeah that's not a fraud thing that's a free of cost and you should use it right and that's it for the third point let's move with the fourth <coughs> for the fourth point is i have shared a uh, excel sheet with you all guys and uh, you can check it out in my previous videos i have shared it in many times and you will find a link in uh, some like in a comment or a description of a video uh, i have dedicated a specific video for that thing so you can watch that and you can find the link in the description okay so in the excel sheet um, i have uh, shared a vedan to 500 most important questions for neat and trust me if you are doing it with a perfection those 500 questions you will approximately able to do at least uh, around 30 marks questions in uh, your biology section if you are really doing those 500 questions by heart like not just seeing oh okay this the answer is this so i will take uh, like, like that and you don't know what's going on not like that just go through the concept behind it what from what chapter it is go with that chapter and do like that okay so really that will help you a lot and that's it for the fourth point and uh, of course the last point will be solving all the itpyqs which i sh i should mention in the third point itself but uh, yeah i thought making it a bit longer <laughs> <laughs> just kidding i just forgot to mention it in the third point so yeah i'm mentioning it here now that doing previous year uh, pyqs for biology or for any subject is compulsory and it's really really important to do because you get an idea right and if you go with a blind minded in the exam you won't be able to do uh, questions because those are new to you and yeah you will just uh, get bad score in exam so yeah that's the overall thing about this video and hope you get some knowledge or like some idea how you can prepare for your bio thing in uh, IIT exam and if you have any doubts just ask me in the comment section I might be late in replying all those messages but I surely do. And yeah, that's it for this video. Hope you like this video. And yeah, bye.